Let's look at another example where we can use the cancellation method. We need to find the sum of the series 1 over 1 times 3 plus 1 over 3 times 5 plus 1 over 5 times 7 and so on. Here, the odd term of this sequence will be 1 over, we have odd numbers here, 1, 3, 5. So it will be 2R minus 1. And this odd number is 2 more than this. So it will be in the form of 2R plus 1. We can easily simplify this by if I substitute r as 1 here, so it will be t1, it will be 2 minus 1, 1, and 2 plus 1, 3. Similarly, if I use r equals 2, it will be 4 minus 1, 3, and 4 plus 1, 5, right? But if we take summation here, we will not be able to get the sum of the series easily. What we can do is, in order to use the cancellation method, we need to manipulate the numerator first. So in order to manipulate the numerator, I can write it as multiply by 2 and divide by 2. And the 2 in the numerator can be written as 1 plus 1. So we multiply it by 2, divide it by 2, and keep the other two terms same as it is. Now, in the numerator, we can add and subtract 2r. So 2r plus 1. And I'm subtracting 2r, so it will be negative 2r. And then you have the plus 1 over 2r minus 1 times 2r plus 1. And from the last two terms, if you take negative sign common, it will be in the form of 2r minus 1. And then we can split the terms. So if we split the terms, we'll get 2r plus 1 over 2r minus 1 times 2r plus 1 minus 2r minus 1 over 2r minus 1 times 2r plus 1. Here we can cancel 2r minus 1. Here we can cancel 2r plus 1. So we'll be left with 1 over 2. 1 over 2r minus 1 minus 1 over 2r plus 1. So that is tr. We have tr. We can find t1, t2, t3, t4, and so on, all the terms. And then we can add all of them vertically. So if I use r as 1, we'll get 1 over 2, 1 over 2 times 1 minus 1 minus 1 over 2 times 1 plus 1, which is same as 1 over 2 times 1 over 1 minus 1 over 3. And if we find t2, that will be 1 over 2. Again, now we'll substitute 2 here and 2 here. So we'll have 1 over 3 minus 1 over 5. And then t3 will be equal to half times 1 over 5 minus 1 over 7 and so on. Similarly, tn will be equal to 1 over 2, 1 over 2n minus 1 minus 1 over 2n plus 1. Here we can see that we can cancel our negative 1 over 3, positive 1 over 3, negative 1 over 5, positive 1 over 5 when we add all the terms. Similarly, 1 over 7 will cancel out. And same way, this 1 over 2 and minus 1 will also cancel out. So we'll be left with just 1 over 2 times 1 minus 1 over 2n plus 1. So sum of t1, t2, t3, and so on up to tn is equal to 1 over 2 times 1 minus 1 over 2n plus 1. So this is a sum of the series that is s is equal to 1 over 2 and we can take LCM here so 2n plus 1 minus 1 so it's just 2n over 2n plus 1. We can cancel 2 so we have n over 2n plus 1 and that is the sum of the given series.